Today AT&T announced the Data Pro uh, data package for the iPhone and the iPad. Now it's $25 per month and you have a 2 gigabyte cap. Now before it was $30 with an unlimited uh, data package which was essentially a 5 gigabyte cap. Um, it, it was a soft cap meaning you would hit 5 gigabytes and then they would probably throttle you or uh, either attach a tethering package or or just you know slow you down. So I did some math and I really think I'm going to be switching to Android with this new iPhone coming out because two gigabytes just will not cut it. So first let's the first thing I wanted to talk about was Pandora. Now I listen to Pandora at least 20 minutes a day. Um, I love Pandora. It's such an awesome service. You know I, I listen to it when I'm in the car, uh, wh wherever I'm going. You know I listen to Pandora. So I figured. Each song was maybe two megabytes. Um, that's that's a pretty rough guesstimate considering I don't know what bit rate the songs are in. Uh, I do know that they're higher bit rate over 3G. So within four minutes, you know, a rough est estimate of a song, you have two megabytes of data. So I took 600 uh, minutes, uh, assuming 20 minutes a day, uh, which is pretty close to what I have and you get 300 megabytes. So with 300 megabytes out of the 2048 megabytes that you do get allotted a month, um, that roughly takes up 15% of my data package just on Pandora. Um, now if you were to think, now I get a lot of emails, I get at least two a day. I mean I have lots of emails and attachments tend to be 500 kilobytes to two megabytes. So you can just see how this is going to add up um, to take two gigabytes. Some days I barely break um, 300 megabytes a month. Um, some days I get upward to three to you know three and a half gigabytes of data. Now this is not going to affect everyone. You know there's some people that just don't use enough. Now the iPad users are expectedly they're they're really screwed because before they got bait and switch. They bought the iPad for the thirty dollars a month uh, unlimited data package. You know, I, I would have bought one too. I wanted, you know, you want the data package. Now you're two gigabyte capped on a on a device that can only really, you know, be useful on a data package. Like that's why you bought it. So I'm pretty much, you know, come June seventh, I'm going to, you know, love the new iPhone. It's going to have video chat. It's going to have all this shit. But I'm not going to buy one because it's going to have this two gigabyte cap that's just crippling the the phone. Now, unless they come out and say we're going to Sprint, and Sprint says, you know, we got a five gigabyte cap, uh, then you know I might go over there. But most, it looks like I'm going to Android. So this is just a short video to show how the Data Pro package is going to suck for pro pro you know users, people who who you know use their phone like a uh, like they should, you know, a lot. And this is just some rough math. So if it's wrong. I'm pretty sure it's not wrong, but you know what I mean. So if it's wrong, then fucking call me a flamer in the comments. I don't care. So that's my video for today. Uh, thanks for watching.